Good morning, class. Uh, this is your introduction video for Cycle 2 folder. So please pay close attention, and if you have any questions, put it in the questions parking lot in the Cycles folder. So you will click on your German class, and as soon as you see your virtual Bitmoji classroom, uh, you can click on the Cycle 2 folder right underneath the German class. That'll open up your folder. And as always, the very first page, you'll have an instructions page. The video is the video that I'm making now, actually. You'll have your objectives. So we're learning about the alphabet, the colors, and numbers 1 to 10 this cycle. Um, all the assignments should be completed by the end of cycle 2, which is on October 9th. And then I'll show you the enrichment shoulder, uh, the enrichment folder, and they may be completed anytime. For the first cycle, uh, I'm sorry, for the second cycle, you'll receive a Schoology badge that will give you three spaces for the Candyland board, three virtual class Euros, and two more Hornet Fives. And then you'll find the live session e classroom information down here, which will have the time. This is for uh, eighth grade, so don't pay attention to this time if you're in sixth or seventh grade. As I said before, questions parking questions parking lot is here. If you have any, please put them in this discussion so that other students might see them in case they have the same question. If you have a different question, please send me a message. I'm sorry, a question that you don't want other students to see, then just send me a, a message on Schoology or an email. So uh, cycle two's assignments are on activity board number two. You're gonna go through the activities in order. If you click on number one, it'll take you to um, some various activities that will uh, teach you the German alphabet. So this is the phonetic spelling, meaning how do I pronounce the letters in German? I'll go through them quickly. A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, O, P, Q, R, S, T, U, V, V, X, Y, and Z. And the numbers one through ten. Null, eins, zwei, drei, vier, fünf, sechs, sieben, acht, neun, and zehn. And S, Z is a letter in German we don't have, and it just makes the sound of double S. Then there's a few videos to go along with the alphabet. So go ahead and watch them. When you're finished with the videos, click on the Quizlet link and it'll prompt you to play the match game with Quizlet, but you may also play Gravity and do the flashcards or anything you want to on that Quizlet to study the alphabet. When you feel comfortable that you understand the alphabet and how the letters are pr pronounced, move on to number two or part two in the cycle two folder on the activity board and click that link. And this will take you to a Schoology quiz, and you'll have three attempts. And you'll listen to me spelling out different three or four letter words. And the words might be in English or in German, but I'll be spelling them in German. And you're gonna do your best to fill in the letters to spell the correct word. When you're finished, at the very end, the last question, um, we'll ask you to record yourself using the audio recording tool. And so click on the microphone and you'll record yourself spelling your first name as best you can. When you're finished with that, go back to the activity board and you'll click on D Farben, which is the colors. And the colors are here for you. And then there's a couple videos. These are actually ed puzzles, which means they're videos with question. So it'll go through the video and then ask you questions throughout. 
And then when you're finished, game three, five, six, or seven, you may choose from. So click on the link. And then you'll choose any of the games from those numbers that you'd like to play. And you can play them as much as you'd like. And when you're finished that, uh, you'll go to flashcards on Quizlet. And again, when you go to the flashcards or when you go to Quizlet, you can play matching or gravity and do the flashcards as well as much as you want. When you're comfortable with that, go to the Schoology assessment. It'll be another small assessment with a few attempts and you'll finish that up learning the colors. Duolingo is number six. So you'll click on this and it's going to give you a good explanation on how to sign into Duolingo with your BASD email and how to add German as one of your courses. And then you'll go through the basics, which will take five to 10 minutes, and it'll give you a goal or uh, points for your daily goal. Take a screenshot of that. And then you are going to reply to this discussion post and paste the screenshot by clicking on the file icon and finding that screenshot in your downloads. So post that reply, and that is number six on the activity board. And then you have a Gim Kit and Kahoot games to play, um, which will be on the colors and numbers one through 10 in German. And then the Labyrinth game will be number nine, the final assignment on the activity board. And for this one, you're going to hear the numbers in German and choose the correct number that you hear. Okay, so go through. And once you click on the number that they say, they'll say a new number. All right, so work through that as best you can. And that are that is the assignments that are due for cycle two. If you'd like to receive the Hornet badge for cycle two, go into the enrichment folder and you'll be doing a flip grid where you will listen, where you'll listen to me spelling a word and you'll guess what the word is I'll be spelling it in German, of course. Um, the words may be in English or in German, and you'll guess what it is. And then you can also leave a recording of yourself spelling a word in German, and then your classmates will click on your video and then try to guess what you're spelling out. And for participating in this Flipgrid activity, you'll get one space on the Candyland board, two Klassen Euro or Class Euros and one more Hornet 5. Okay, so that's the work in the cycle. If you have any questions, um, please don't hes hesitate to put a question in the questions parking lot or send me a message on Schoology or an email. All right, choose for now.